flow and collected is really the level of the pulse. Collected means the pulse got to come up. I don't mind about that. These horses aren't showing FBI dressage, so the pole can stay low. So let's just think about slowing step. Just, just accept the slow and then back to your medium. Now to activate the, the medium walk to get a good quality, I like to use mostly seats. I like to use mostly seats in the walk, not so much spurt. And just like the changes of gears with your trot work, it's about monitoring how much half halt, how much leg, to keep everything fluid and in the correct rhythm. Okay, let's have six slow steps of walk again. Excellent. Both of you, excellent. Very, very good, Kay. Why was it excellent? Because A, the horses stayed relaxed, and they kept the tempo, they kept the tempo of the walk even, and the rhythm didn't change. Now just to explain that, the tempo is the speed. The rhythm is the four beats. One, two, three, four. Uh, sometimes in the walk, it gets a bit lateral, which is, it turns into a two beat walk. So that's what I mean by the rhythm staying correct. Okay, once again, some slow steps of walk. See if you can go a little slower this time. Six steps. Keep your seat active. Keep your seat active. Keep the hind end active. And then forward again. Okay, so Kay, where might you move, where might you use this slow steps of walk in an upper level dressage test? Yeah, in fact, in the advanced day test, it says two or three slow steps. Or it says shorten the stride two or three steps and then canter. Absolutely. Almost before any walk is up to yep. transition. And the other place would be, like you said, a walk transition to a half pirouette. Sorry, a, mm -hmm. they call it an eventing half turn on the horses. Right. Okay. So just as important is that half pirouette or half turn on the horses is the slowing down step. So look at me. If I was doing a half pirouette to the left, I'd have shoulder four, slow step from shoulder four, and then we're turn on the heart. And then horses, if you watch in that two and three star test, that have to do it both levels, uh, they get tight and tense in the slowing down walk part. So of course you don't have any chance of keeping the turn on the heart is fluid. All right, so let's do uh, some slowing down steps and then change the rein do a turn on the forehead. Jasmine, I'd like you to watch K because we already did this in the last lesson. So slow down steps with shoulder four. And Jasmine, the turn on the forehead is in motion. It's not on the spot like we learned in Pony Club. <laughs> Kay, I'd like you to demonstrate that turn on the forehead again. But I think you should be describing about a three meter circle, not a 10. Okay. So three meters is about a length of a show jump pole. So Jazz, when you see the haunches going around, that was really perfect. And you'll see some from, from the video, not only are we stretching the hind end, but the shoulders are also getting some, okay? Let's see you do one. So first of all, get your right flexion, and then slowing down steps, and then you're turning the forehead. Turning, turning, turning. Good girl, turning. And halt, halt, right there. 